everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Ariana, also known as the Happy God Girl with Happy God Girl Productions. And we are back with a testimony on a Monday, also known as Testa Monday. Today is somewhat of a small testimony to some people, but it was really big to me and I thank God that this happened. Let's go backwards about five years. I moved into a place, it was really affordable, but some of the appliances were older. One thing that I definitely wanted replaced was my stove. However, you know, it, I was just grateful. I had a stove, I'm grateful I have a kitchen, all that good stuff, I had an affordable place. I was very grateful. I took very good care of that stove, um, including like deep cleaning it, lifting up the cooktop, cleaning underneath, you know, deep cleaning my um, oven and everything, um, keeping it clean in between those deep cleanings. Fast forward to this year, and I was like, Lord, I really want a new stove. Basically, I, I remember talking and trying to get advice from people about how I could go about getting a new stove. Um, and I remember getting advice saying like, hey, you've been there for five years, just let them know like you've been here for five years. And you know, they need to give you a new stove. I don't think there was anything wrong with that advice. However, I didn't feel peace about going about it that way. Um, so I just decided to wait on God and see what he was going to do with the situation. So the, the state of my stove was getting progressively worse. Like at this time, um, one of my burners I wasn't even using because it was just um, causing like a smoke smell every time I tried to use it. So this is basically what led to me being like, Lord, this year I really want a new stove. And um, I just trusted him with that. Fast forward a little bit, maybe a couple months, um, I went to deep clean my stove and I was like, I really don't want to. Like, I just want a new stove. I'm just done with this thing. Um, but I felt that that wasn't how it works. I felt the Lord was like, you need to still take care of your stove until the very end. Um, and so I, I went to clean it. I lifted up the cooktop and when I started cleaning, sparks flew at me from somewhere. So I have an electric stove. Yeah, it's not gas. So that means it's electric, right? So sparks flew at me. I was like, okay, like this stove is about to kill me. I'm so done with this. But I still followed through. And um, with the spark situation, I was like, I probably should tell my landlord about that. And what happened was they sent someone over to take a look at it and he was like oh we probably can replace you know repair it that's what he said we can repair it um and I was like okay that was fine I just couldn't use that like that whole side that where the sparks were but I could still use this side however I used one of the burners and it I was like burning my food and I was like what is going on I'm, you know my stuff is on medium I have no idea what's going on and um it turns out that one of the burners was just consistently on high if I turned it on low if I turned it on warm it didn't matter it was going to go straight to high and um, so I called the guy who was who was coming up with the quote to repair the stove and he was like hey you need to turn off your stove via the breaker you need to like turn it off and I was like oh, okay and so he was like I'm gonna call your property management and give them this update um, so he called me back, I think that same day or maybe the next day, and he was like, yeah, we need to replace that stove. Uh, the, the repairs, it's, it's going to cost more than that stove is worth. So uh, they're going to repair it. I mean, they're going to replace it. And I was so happy. I was so happy. God had completely did it and he did it his way. I just thank God so much for just hearing a small desire of my heart and just honoring um that that small desire that i had and it was just such a blessing i ended up having a new stove within i think about a week and um even a new hood everything it was just so it's so much better it fits better in the spot that it's in i have um so much gratitude in my heart for what God has done, I am just so grateful. So I just wanted to encourage you. If you have a big desire, a small desire, it doesn't matter if you take it to the Lord and you just believe that he is going to honor it and honor your request. 
and you do your part, you know, because I still had to be a good steward over what I had, even though I wanted something else. If you just do what you need to do and you put the rest in his hands and you don't try to force anything that you're not feeling led to do, then he will work it out for you. So I really hope this encourages you and that you have a blessed day and leave your comments. Let me know what has God done for you? What testimony can you share with saints who happen to be coming across this video that might encourage them? You guys have a blessed day and I will talk to you soon.